Yeah, I told you, didn't have enough oil. I don't have enough oil in the motor. And when I say that, that's a, here's a quick tip for you guys. You have to put more oil than what the manual says. 0.6 liters of oil. That's exactly how much oil is required by volume to run the motor. But that assumes that the motor is going to be running level. These motors don't run level. They run at that angle. And that angle is just so that it will tip off the oil sensor. Add an extra ounce or two of oil in it. Oh, look, look, look like a big moccasin, man. I think there's a stick. Happens every time I change the oil. I, I put exactly the requisite amount in there and then add maybe an ounce at a time until it stops doing that. And consequently, if your motor's knocking out like that, oh crap, no! I'm up here on a dang I'm log, are you kidding me? This is why you have backup equipment, guys. You never know what the heck's gonna happen or why. Oh, come on. There we go. Yep, see? I don't really like coming back into these creeks and stuff. Update on the hand liner's handbook. I'm on page 60 right now. What I need to do now is just, I'm getting out here. I got some other ideas I need to experiment with. That's one thing. More importantly, I just need to take lots of pictures. That's in the process of doing that right now. Thanks you guys for watching these videos. I know you like them. I like doing them. And if you need to, if you don't have enough oil in the motor, you need to run, level it out like this. Get the RPM up and then drop it.